Good afternoon. Welcome to Kendall in Cumbria for the finish of stage two of the 2016 Tour of Britain. And it's a difficult one today. 188 kilometres for the riders to negotiate and a huge amount of climbing as well. If we were still in Scotland, they'd be calling this weather Dreich as well. Pretty damp out there. We're now with the race live. And uh, I can tell you that you're looking at a group of some 15 riders that slipped away in the very early stages of today's second leg. A stage that's got 3,700 metres of climbing, and this could well be one of the selection days for the eventual uh, winner of the uh, yellow jersey. Rider from BMC is Loic Vleigen, but then the big fella, look at him, Connor Dunn, big rangy Irishman. He's being stalked there by Greipel. Greipel's all over Dunn like a rush, and it is the iceberg yellow jersey wear of Andre Greipel that takes the second sprint of the day from Connor Dunn. Well, what's happened there? Why has he sort of touched a wheel? And, That's Costa. Uh, yeah, taking a bang on the ribs. Oh, oh. there it was. It, I can only think it was one of the cat's eyes he had. Well, just a tad inside, 50 kilometres now left of racing, 120 the advantage. And still, the front of the peloton have not found the answer to finally pulling this leading group back. 16 kilometres to go, Dennis on the front, still really keen to uh, whip the pace up, and he's caused a slight fracture here as Nicholas Roach comes across. So Vermont, who has been away all day in this group, that at one point had a lead of five minutes, finally pulled back on the uh, summit of the struggle. And since then, we've been introduced to attack after attack. In fact, the last half an hour has been embroidered, encrusted with compelling action. And the upshot of it is we're left with these two riders at the business end of the contest with nine and a half kilometres to go. 200 metres to go. Here goes Vermont. Vermont looks as though he's going to go first. Now then, can Steve Cummings respond to this? Vermont's gone away. Steve Cummings cannot respond to the effort from the Belgian. The 24-year-old Belgian, Julian Vermont's going to clinch stage two here in Kendall at the summit of Beast Banks. Here he comes. Julian Vermont of Etix Quickster wins stage two. And Steve Cummings of Dimension Data and Great Britain comes over the line to finish in second place. So here we are. This is the uh, result of the stage. Julian Vermont winning a very tough stage to Kendall. There is the overall standings in the race after two stages. Vermort is the leader with a six-second cushion over Cummings, as we now see the winner of the stage and the new leader of the Tour of Britain, collecting the yellow jersey presented by Iceberg, and that's Julian Vermont.